It's Critical Art 64, Caesar here, with the third portrait in the 36 Chambers of Art Challenge, the Chamber of Darkness. Um, for this chamber, I'm using a style that I'll call contrast anime style. Uh, we've seen this style used in things like the Animatrix, Persona, Afro Samurai, and as a more recently Red Line. I mean, the artist for uh, Animatrix, Afro Samurai, and Red Line is Takeshi Koike. Takeshi Koike, which is one of my favorite anime directors. Now, this style is particularly tricky because the core shadows are blacked out, uh, somewhat like the American comic book style, but the only difference is that the sh it has to be composed in such a way that it is easy to animate. Now, I remember having a really hard time trying to draw the Afro Samurai style as a kid because I didn't ha have an understanding of lighting. Another thing about this sort of style so it takes a lot of it takes a really clear uh, it takes a really clear rough sketch or plan to execute well and that was something that I kind of messed up on here is that I, I didn't spend enough time on the rough sketch so you'll see me redraw parts of the picture and abuse the liquify tool but when it comes to doing art pieces that's your planning phase is the most important since I didn't you know I didn't really uh, work on the rough sketch too much because I was cocky and I thought I could just fix the drawing as I ink. You know, that, that's a really tough thing about this challenge is that usually it takes a few pieces to really hit your stride in a style, even a really uh, simple one, but I'm trying to just knock these out on the first try. And I also wanted to pick a, a palette that looks like uh, the original uh, cell animation art style. You know, when they used to actually use paints on transparent uh, plastic to color the cartoons. Doing a touch up there, I had some squiggles in my lines, a little bit of wavy lines, so I've had to redraw them a few times. Doing some detail work here. And since it was this darkness challenge, I eventually decided to go with more of a nighttime look. Kind of like, uh, I'm, I think of Ninja Scroll. Yeah, that's pretty much sums up the drawing. You know, you always have to flip to make sure that the proportions are correct. Uh, if you flip the image, you can see your mistakes a little bit better. But that about covers the challenge here. Uh, stay tuned for the next one. I'll play you guys out on the beat. And if you need to contact me for any reason, all my social media is in the description below.